Hey guys, Zach Uwak here, back with another Roblox Studio tutorial. In this video, we're going to be learning how to utilize proximity prompts in Roblox Studio and using them to create a health pick. Okay, so first up, let's create the actual model for our healing part. We're going to add a block. And let's just make it green. For now, that can be it. Now inside this part, let's add a proximity prompt. Click on it. Oh, and let's rename the part to heal. Now let's click on the proximity prompt. And over here in the data section, you can see a lot of its properties. These are the main ones we can worry about. This is just if you're playing on a console. And over here is the hold duration, which is how long you have to hold the proximity prompt for the item to heal you. Let's do three seconds. So it's not too fast, but it's not too long either. Now the keyboard key code, which is what you have to press for three seconds to activate it. Let's keep that at E and let's make the max activation distance five studs. And in object text, let's write press E to heal. And this is what will show up when you're five studs away. Now inside the proximity prompt, let's write a script. Delete the default code and we'll write this. Here, we're just defining some simple things, and this is where we'll take the health away. And let's just quickly add a zombie. Oh, and don't forget to anchor this part. Okay, so now let's take a little bit of damage from the zombie and make it go away from the health block so we have time to use it. Now let's go back to our health block. And there you go, we get 15 health back. Okay guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something new and don't forget to subscribe to stay tuned for further Roblox Studio content.